There, the door is finally open, Araman. We have waited and done all you asked. Araman, I owe you the wages of your treachery. I told you the girl doesn't deserve this. We do it quickly and mercifully or I'll have no part. Silence. Wait. I alone slew Nephris to set things right, to make amends for my crimes. Do you know my face? The face of a brother who once ran laughing in your wake? My smiles have faded, and your face has changed many times. But something of you must still remain. Not the memories of this mask you now wear, but they are yours, yes. What lunacy? Araman, what is this? With respect, I see no reason to play yet more games with- Turn away. Cast your eyes back to Rashomon. To home. Leave this place now, and none will hinder you. Beyond that door you may find truth, but also folly. A folly that will sunder the plains and render meaningless all that you have suffered. I remember similar words and a similar promise. And now, we both suffer. But if you are intent upon this, then I cannot protect you any further. My fight is not with you. He is mad. Madder than Nephris ever was. Come, let's make an end to this before he changes his mind. Master Javi, please. You and I, we live with Thayan ambition and treachery all around us. It taints our actions. But I know that our friendship was never a lie. Perhaps, my dear, but I... I know you stood by, watched as they murdered my mother. I know you must think that condemns you to their side, but it doesn't. They would have killed you for opposing them. You are the same man who comforted a frightened girl, terrified of the voices in her mind, and taught her to craft little chattering creatures of twigs and clay. Real voices to drown out the false. You shame me, my dear. Surviving has become a habit. If I am to break it, you are the best of reasons. Fine. We'll appoint another in your place, Jaffe. A wizard with more sense and fewer wrinkles. You are... Oh, I don't know any profanity. How embarrassing. Easy as dreaming.